Hello, Sagittarius. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly weekend, sorry, weekly love reading for the week of February 14th through the 21st, 2022. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I'm closing off with my Steampunk Tarot by Barbara Moore. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, and subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right. What's going on with the Sagittarius? Sagittarius, Sagittarius, Sagittarius. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right, so we got vulnerability reversed here, okay? I do feel like somebody may be taking uh, advantage of somebody's emotional state, okay? I feel like somebody is or somebody was. Okay, let's keep going. All right, so we got the new beginning card, okay? This is the new beginning card to me. So I do feel like somebody may have started something new. Of course, possibly some kind of pregnancy here. Or just like Fertile Ground, something is getting ready to turn into something else, okay? Alright, ooh, so we got Sanctuary card here. So I do feel like somebody's starting something new, um, and I, they being stalked, okay? So it's like you just got a new relationship, you started a new job. Um, you left one firm and went to another, and the previous situation is watching you, okay? But you could be the previous situation watching someone else. Let's keep going. All right, so letting go. So I do feel like somebody needs um, that closure, and I feel like this closure is to see this person in this new light, see this person with this uh baby or see this person with um this new beginning or starting this for them to be able to um let go okay i don't know why i'm gonna just say this before i go any further i feel like somebody may uh, maybe some kind of firm or some kind of somewhere where i feel like you cannot take this information from this place and 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 take it to your own business so it's somewhere where you can take still information or oh okay so like i'm gonna just try to like cubine this um is a place where they do um spa the spa treatments or they do like waxing and stuff um i do feel like it's some energy where the workers at this place like somebody's getting ready to leave and try to steal some of the clients Okay, that's the energy that I'm feeling from that. Okay, so somebody's trying to steal the like the patients, or I don't know if they call it patients, clients. Somebody's trying to steal the clients. So that's kind of situation I'm still still in here. Okay, see in here. Okay, it's like somebody may have gotten let go, but I feel like I'm not going out alone, or I already know that I did something to get in trouble. So I'm going to take everything. Or take all these people that like me before I leave, okay? Mm-hmm. And I do feel like somebody just walked away from the situation. Like, oh, I can do this by myself. And they, they still in clients on the way out, okay? Let's keep going. Okay. We're trying to steal clients, you know. Um, but I do feel like if this is not a business situation, I do feel like this may be a um, relationship situation where somebody's uh, trying to steal somebody's partner. Okay, so with the Huvine thing, I feel like, of course, this person left. I feel like the owner of Huvine is watching uh the other person to try to see if they actually still in clients okay but i do feel like it's not going to be long okay i'm just using that as an example that it's not what's happening okay <laughs> at least not to that business at least i just use that because 
that's the only place I can think of right now that take clients, okay? All right, let's keep going. But like I said, in a relationship, this is somebody walking away and then they're being watched by the person from before. All right, so we got the honesty card here. So I do feel like somebody's trying to get a real and direct answer. A real and direct answer. And I feel like with this person leaving me, I feel like I'm not going to get that from them. So I feel like I got to stalk them to get the real answer, okay? Okay. All right, so we got the Wonder Voyage cross. Okay, the Voyage card, <laughs> okay? So with this Voyage card, I do feel like somebody is moving along, moving forward, okay? I do feel like I want to watch and see where this person moved to or what this person has going on and see it if, you know, if this person really then did something to me or is this new? But I feel like somebody already got a sense that this person is doing something that is. I feel like somebody sensed that this person is doing something that's not good because whatever it is, is getting ready to start. And I feel like it's got a lot of power behind it. So this person starting a new relationship and the baby is like seven months, somebody seven months pregnant. So of course this relationship started before this relationship started before the ending of this relationship. Okay. All right. Yes. So we got the separation. It was a cut, cut and dry separation. It was all out the blue. Okay. So I do feel like, you know, six, seven months went by and somebody like, okay, this person is not going to expect, Set me having a child on the outside. Okay. So I just got to get out of here. Okay. So it, whatever this ending was, it was sudden. It was a sudden ending. All right. So we got the receptivity card here. Wow. So somebody, I don't know. I'll probably be stalk, stalking too. If somebody just left out the blue and then next thing you know, they uh, blocked me. You left out the blue and you blocked me. I have no way to see you, contact you to see what the heck going on, okay? Like, I still care about you. You know, I want to know what happened. All right, so we got the... Oh, goodness. All right, so I do feel like whatever this this new situation is a stable situation, okay? Um, but I also feel like some kind of celebration is happening. But it could be a grand opening or this could be... You know, somebody is celebrating the, the baby shower or something like that. Mm -hmm. Baby shower, engagement, wedding. I feel like it could be just a new relationship, but this new relationship is going to be fruitful. Okay. There's a lot of care and love there. Okay. Definitely some children come in with this sun card, but that's happiness. We got the page of wands. I do feel like somebody's blocking things from the in the past and moving forward. So somebody's moving forward and not looking back at all. Okay? I'm not looking back. Not looking back. All right, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Sagittarius. Sagittarius, Sagittarius. All right, so we got the High Priestess card reversed here. Feminine uh, energy, secrets getting ready to come out, okay? So, of course, you only can hide a kid for so long, had a relationship for so long. So we got the Queen of Pentacles reversed here. So I do feel like um, somebody is going to be more reserved with their time and, and their money. I'm not giving as much as I used to. All right, so we got the Hermit card here. So I do feel like... I'm not giving as much time as I used to, and I feel like somebody's getting ready to go into isolation and really think about um, how they want to spend the rest of their life, okay? How they want to spend their time. All right, so we got the Four of Swords. So I do feel like somebody's trying to mentally recover from this situation, and I feel like that's why I got to go look back. I feel like I'm not just going to stalk this person Um I'm trying to figure out what I did wrong as well, okay? Or see if I did anything wrong 
um, see if I missed anything. What what are the signs that I missed? How how did not know? Okay. How did not see this coming? All right. So we got the sun card here. So I do feel like you know. Okay, I do feel like with this new way of thinking, this new way of life, I do feel like happiness is going to be there. Okay, I feel like contentment is going to be there. All right, so we got the Six of Swords. I do feel like somebody is basically, I mean, it's in a peaceful place, but I feel like more traveling or um, somebody may be getting ready to move because of this. I get that too. Um, it's like I really care about somebody and then they did me wrong. And I can't keep looking out these windows at these trees or at this water. You know, I got to go. So it looked like somebody may get, be about to move. Mm -hmm. All right. So we got the four wands here. So I do feel like somebody's getting ready to move. I feel like somebody's about to move to help they self emotionally um, get better. Um, but I also feel like. Somebody's just creating some more stability they self. Um, I do feel like emotionally and physically with these swords and these um, wands. Okay, beautiful. So we got the Ace of Cups here. So I do feel like, you know, somebody's going to be spending their time a little bit better. Okay, with this Ace of Pentacles, somebody could be getting ready to start a new business start a new life but i do feel like somebody's getting ready to be more money oriented um and stop like just giving themselves away emotionally so easily okay but other than that that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs thanks for watching